Hello everybody, it's Charlie again. I am currently playing Dumpless. And this will be my second playthrough. I'm sure the first one was kind of fun. I want to see what the taking down the monsters is like. and It looks pretty cool, they have a little hub world. So yeah, let's get into it. Hope you guys enjoy. Alright guys, so we're back here in Dauntless with my awesome created character. And as you can see, it's nighttime, which is really cool. I just thought it would be daytime all the time, but nope. I do have a day and night cycle, apparently. And what's this? Ooh, cinematic to where? Where are we going? It just kind of shows you around. Yeah, I'm not really sure yet how to like accept the quest or how to take off to fight a monster, so I'm kind of figuring that out as I go. Uh, and yeah, we'll see how it goes. I mean, so far the game is, in my opinion, better than, or just my cup of tea more so than the other game that I played. Uh, what's it called? Can't even remember. Oh, Smite. Yeah, Smite had the same art style, you know, which is like mobile game art style, <laughs> that's what I call it, and uh, you know, it's cartoony, cell shaded type style, but this one seems to have the better gameplay, and has less frame drops and stuff, it just seems to be a more stable game, I mean, don't get me wrong, it has slowed down, I, I felt it a few times, but it's not game breaking in any way, where, you know, you're just like, oh, fuck this, you know, and I'm gonna get off. <laughs> No. Oh, that's why. Okay, it's a Halloween theme. Well, that's perfect, actually. Because uh, pretty soon, I'm going to do a week of Halloween games. I'm still trying to pick which ones would be the most worth doing. Because uh, you guys don't know this about me, but I do love Halloween. It's probably one of my favorite um, days of the year. The problem is that I'm not really into the games they make for it. They just make, you gotta admit, a lot of games based on horror are not really well done and they don't really scare me. So I don't wanna pretend like I'm scared either, you know? Ooh, see that? But yeah, so that's just how I am, you know, I just, I mean, I know a lot of YouTubers do that, you know, so they can get views. And I'm not really the trendy type you know, if you don't like my channel, that's cool. I mean, it's not going to be for everybody. <laughs> but um, at least you'll know that I'm being honest. And thats I think that's what matters to me the most. At least for now, till I sell out. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm not going to sell out. <laughs> but isn't that funny, though? You expect like your favorite YouTubers to never sell out. But those people got paid bills, man. I, I mean, I get their predicament. Yeah, I just, I'm not really that type of person. I'm not really looking for, like, to make billions. Just want to make enough to live and maybe save a little bit of money. And just enjoy myself, because I, I will play video games till I'm a freaking, if I make it to old age, I'm going to be, I'm going to be tearing it up in video games for quite a while. Can't wait to see what the future holds. But it looks like I got some medic packs and shit like that. I can't get into... Let me go ahead and talk to this guy. Smiggles. He has an exclamation point. Oh no, Marcus Boyer. Mm. Complete. Main quest completed. Okay. Alright. So it's him I have to talk to. I uh, complete your conversation, then press to go to the. Okay. Ooh, what are these? I guess we'll find out. Cool. Unlock potential. Unlock the battlegrounds. 
suggests setting sail for training grounds. Main quest completed. Yeah, you guys already uh, explained that to me. What's all this shit? Anytime you need to travel, just follow the icon on the hunt map. Interact with the hunt map and select the training grounds. Trainer Rosk is, is in demand matchmaking for a ground training grounds may take a moment. Okay. Okay, so it's him I had to talk to. His exclamation point is gone, so I'm guessing I'm done with him for now. And what's this? Messages and shit. I got email. Okay, so we're gonna go to hunting grounds. Oh, they want me to go to training grounds first. Fine. We can do that. Deport in 28 seconds. So yeah, I'm obviously gonna skip this in the video. All right, guys. Looks like we're in the training grounds here. Damn, that character just looks badass, man. Trainer Rock. Weapon overview. You gonna teach me how to use the weapons? I like swords, so I'm kind of gonna stick to swords. I don't mind an axe. But holy shit, this is a giant axe. Okay. Ooh, it's hammer time. They got a hammer. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, that's cool. <laughs> the oversized weapons are funny. There's even a shotgun, I think. I don't know what it shoots. Right, but you guys let me fight that other time by myself, so I don't know. Oh, you could just change weapons at any time. But like I said, I like swords, so. But I'm, it's it's good to know that you know. Some people like the guns. This is kind of cool. And yeah, like I said, it uses basic. Um, square and X to jump which is cool square to attack X to jump and I think heavy attacks are yeah triangle so it's very basic I think it's it's a pick up and play kind of game and it's free to play guys that's the best part right I gotta say this is one of the best free to play games I've played in a while so far but yeah now that we know what battlegrounds is and a place where to get the weapons we're gonna go ahead and What's this? Okay, so you can't really break environment stuff. It's not a big deal, whatever. Uh, hunt. Yeah, we're going to hunting grounds. What's this? Alright, finding slayers. I think we're just gonna go now. Because, yeah. Oh, very nice. Okay. I'm gonna go for a little hunt. You like my spacecraft? <laughs> I don't know what the fuck that is. It's like a mixed world, you know, of like the past and present, you know, those kind of worlds. But I do got my sword. I forgot my sword. You gotta admit, swords are like the best. Especially in these kind of games, you know? I mean, I don't know what the damage is on each weapon or what it does, but. It's cool that you can team up with people and like, I don't know, and, and the weird thing is I'm not much into fantasy stuff, but there's stuff that calls my attention for whatever reason. Wait, what's this? Can I touch it? No, it doesn't let me touch it. That's weird. Okay. Oh, no, they're down. They need my help. Backup is on its way. Don't die. Don't die. Oh, they're probably just gonna fucking die on me. What the hell are they fighting? Oh no, they're good, they're good. Okay, hey guys, what's up? How you doing? Invite to party? No, I'm good. I mean, technically I need help, right? I don't know, I guess we'll figure it out. So 
So I'm guessing you're supposed to find a creature and engage the creature. Oh shit, I don't want to fall off the ledge. Let me get that. Let me get some of that though. You want to join my party? Huh? Invite to party. Add epic friend. Oh, he's been following me for like two hours. No, I just want to find a beast and slay it. I want to see what it's like to fight it alone. To see if it's really that difficult, you know? I like to test the game's difficulty. Because sometimes they make it like... Like, for example, um... <clears throat> some games will tell you that you're playing on hard mode. But then you'll notice weird things like... When you don't do something, the creatures aren't really attacking you. It's, it's just try to trick people by just saying oh it's gonna be really tough when you get in here and then you get in there and you're like oh, this is fucking trash bruh alright what we got up here can I open it? how the fuck you open wait 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 whoa, 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 whoa. she's crazy you have no okay so you need keys gotcha I wasn't even reading that shit. In the meanwhile, we're gonna collect some of this stuff before we fight a creature. I'm guessing he's super tough. I mean, I've only fought one creature, and that was like basically the introduction to the game. So I'm pretty sure they're gonna be a lot tougher than that, dude. And it wasn't that big either. Definitely a giant creature, but not that big. Ooh, where? Oh shit, he ran away. Fuck. Oh, I guess tonight he was coming back. Ooh, look at that behemoth breaker. Well, I think, well, yeah, it's a lot easier when you have friends, that's for sure. But I still want to see if I can engage on level one. Sword skill. Oh, let's see. More details? Okay. Is that it? That was, a, that was a creature? Was that the behemoth? Behemoth? Let's see what's in here. Uh, yeah, that might have been the creature. But it's weird. I mean, I thought it was going to just be me. I don't know why I, ha I even had people backing me up. Yeah, the design of the game is nice to look at. It gives you a very welcoming vibe, so... You know? I'm not gonna lie, though. The design is very similar to Fortnite. <laughs> but the gameplay is not, so that's good. The gameplay is different. Like, even when you move sideways and stuff, the movement is completely different. And I think the graphics here are better. That could just be me. I don't know. The training. Why do I have to go back to the training grounds? I'm hunting, bro. Ram's Gate. Let's find out what that is. Call airship. Finding Slayers. Yeah, we're gonna go now. Alright, guys, so. We're back in the hub world. As you can see, we went for a little short hunt. I just wanted to see what it was like. It looks like hunts can already be started before you get in there. Uh, I don't quite know what I'm doing yet, so I'm going to go ahead and play the game off screen, you know, when I'm not doing the videos. And then when I level up a few times and I know exactly what to do, I'll come back to the game. But so far, hey, it ain't bad, man. It ain't bad. And it's probably even more fun when you have friends, you know? It probably feels even better when you're taking down people together and stuff. This is very nice in here. But yeah, guys, like I said, yeah, as I go on and I'll make sporadic videos of this game. If I continue to get into it or it feels good, then yeah, I'll come back. Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please like and subscribe when you get a chance. And like I always say, cooking. <laughs>